down to it. The last four players left in the tournament. Only one of these players are going to be walking away with the championship plus an invite to the winter courts in late 2019. So first up, we've got uh, William versus Ronnie. We've given both players a few minutes to take a look at each other's deck list so that they'll know what to expect. And likewise, we're going to do the same with you today. So we're going to start with William. William's playing a uh, unique flavor of uh, Phoenix deck. He's playing the uh, Corset Stronghold. Yep, yep. It's Sawamori Sado. He's been using that quite effectively throughout yeah. the rounds. And it's a it's like a primarily a dishonor strategy, right? That's yes. the way his deck works. Yes. Mm -hmm. So let's go through some of his lists. Now, just to note, uh, we, we, we tried to translate his deck from paper to electronic. There's something uh, some things that didn't show up in our app. Yeah, but anyway. Uh, so we have on his uh, dynasty side, you're seeing Ethereal Dreamers, the Sakosukis. The, uh, the ones that I want to point out that aren't in standard, I guess, like competitive Phoenix decks are Asako Diplomat. You don't see that much anymore. Uh, Meddling Mediator, yep, three copies yep. of that too. That's a big red flag when you're playing against an opponent that you see a Meddling Mediator or an Asako Diplomat. Yeah. You notice that it's not the usual uh, uh, Phoenix deck. When yeah, those come up, and you're not playing Isawa uh, Mido. No, uh, is it Saido? Isawa Mori Saido. Isawa Mori yeah. Saido. Yeah. I, I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly or whatever, but yeah. yeah. And then looking at his uh, his conflict pile, you look at uh, his splash scorpion. I mean, the first time your uh, William is playing his backhandedly compliments on you, it's probably going to be when you're at three or less honor, and he's got all three copies in him. So generally what he's going to try to do, he's going to try to uh, uh, start off around, I guess, turn three or four, depending on how the game's going, just aggressively bidding one. Yep. Right? And uh, I think it's also uses things to push you off. Big dependent on certain matchups, too. Like, depending on who he's against, he'll probably bid higher for the first time and then start bidding low and then start trading them out of resources. Because, like... The Forgotten Library is going to give them a consistent card draw. And uh, no uh, big attachments, it seems. Uh, yeah, Daidoji, Eric. Uh, it's asking about only two Dreamers. Well, I, I don't think it's common because uh, William's deck is not a common version of a Phoenix mm -hmm. deck. As we mentioned, mm -hmm. at the mm -hmm. start of this round, it's uh, it's a Dishonor deck. Yeah. This like is you'll... a primarily a Dishonor deck, not an yeah. aggro Phoenix Shigenja deck. So... Uh, typical Kibo of Air. Well, Yo Yoga Kukuyo is like a meta call, right? Yeah. I'm, I'm assuming Ronnie was expecting to run into a bunch of Phoenix decks. Yeah. So that's why he has two copies of Yoga Kukuyo in his yeah. uh, his deck. Like, yeah, his his dynasty pile. And again, there's a couple of cards missing because uh, our uh, deck builder thing is being a little bit foolish. So yeah, it's being a little it, it, the, bleak, can, bleak. But, yeah, but you can see the gist of it, basically. You can see that uh, Doji Challenger, Kikita Asami... Uh, Guest of Honor is, I think, Ronnie's favorite card. Hmm. Isn't it basically the card that he loves the most? Yes. He, hard mulligans for Guest of Honor against, I guess, sort of matchups. It, it'll be very useful in this matchup too, right? You would Interest say so? Yeah, I, yeah. I would. Um, very interesting that both Ronnie and Will are playing uh, Dynasty characters at the, in the restricted list, which means sometimes you might yeah. not even be able to see it. Sometimes you might be able to see it quite often. Yep. Um, Sodomatic X asks, "What is this Discord League?" Well, if you guys if you guys don't know uh, who Ronnie is, Ronnie is Doji Zudutron, who plays in Discord League all the time. So yeah, I would assume that a lot of his deck is uh, informed by his uh, experience and performance in the Discord League itself. Timer has just started. We have got 65 minutes to see which one of these two players are going to end up in the finals. So let's go with uh, Will first. What do you think he wants to see early? Uh, well, against um, Ronnie, I think Asako Diplomat's a strong early play, right? Yeah, yeah. Just the ability to just win conflicts and just kind of... Oh, he should uh, shuffle after he sets those cards aside. Right. Oh, did... So he... Oh, Okay. Well, so he did the ignore, hard version. Oh, ig ignore what Ronnie's doing yet. Yeah, you're supposed to replace the cards before shuffling. It's a little bit too late for that, though. Yeah. Anyway. Well, you might even see them again. So, I mean, low likelihood, but still. I don't know about you, but like, I know. playing six rounds of Elphivar, 
get pretty tiring after round four. Yes. So. And Ronnie just realized that. Uh, <laughs> Ronnie just realized. Ronnie. <laughs> <laughs> I hope he. I hope he ends up with the same exact same cards he just bought. Yeah. Well, I'm trying to be not uh, biased, so yeah, we'll, no, we'll leave it's it fine. <laughs> but no, w- William's actually a very good player. Um, those of you who are familiar with the videos that are on our YouTube channel, we've he's been featured uh, quite a bit. <clears throat> so yeah, uh, what do you think Ronnie's looking for? Like, I don't think. Uh, I don't think Cautious Scouts is important in this matchup. No, is, is I think say Scorpion or I think Dragon, right? In Dynasty side, he probably wants to get either Crash Samurai. Um, what else has he got? Guess of Honor. Thank you, Guess of Honor. Is it Guess of Honor a turn one play for you against? Uh, I Phoenix? think if I have Letgos in my hand, I probably will. Oh sure, yeah. Just because you want to make sure that Guest of Honor does his thing or mm-hmm. her thing. Um, investing four fate on a character like that is sometimes you kind of have to do like an evaluation thing. Do you know if Ronnie is the type of person that's conservative with his fate early on in the game, or does he just spend I think, everything? No, 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 no. no. Um, every time I've played uh, Ronnie back in the day, he is very. Um, Meticulous? Meticulous? Yeah. Okay. About his life. Or like conservative, I guess? Yeah. Yes. So. Well, he plays Scummy Crane. I mean, gotta play like that control. Yeah, Crane sucks. Pass it on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can't stand Crane. It's just. I used to that's be a, an old L5R player. That's, like, a, years, so I just that's a joke from him. Netrunner. A, a dead game. Dead game. <laughs> HP sucks. Pass it on. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, look at that. A Brash Samurai. So an easy way to turn on Voice of Honor really early. And, Actually, uh, having, having a Yoshi flip very early, too, yeah. means that you can really push for the, the favor. But I mean, now, you could also bait Will into attacking that province, too. Yeah. Um, but I think he'll just straight pass. Yeah. So Ethereal Dreamer, the first play for William. Yeah, Ronnie just passed after playing Brash Samurai. See, and then nice student, no fates. I mean, I don't mind actually buying Doji Whisperer as well because I think Will probably will buy another character because. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and big thing change too is the whole like no gaining fate going second. Yeah. A lot of more people that I've seen lately are going first, which is super weird, even for me. But maybe I'm still. Stuck well, going in the old first ways. means that you get the passing fate. Uh, Right. <clears throat> yeah, but the thing is, you get access to the still the access to rings is still the same. Any rings that's not being contested, you get to get for it before you. Well, what I find is going first means that on turn one, depending on what you're you set the momentum. Well, what your opponent bought, you can either go water or void first. Right. Right. Like you have first crack at that. Yeah. So I'm gonna. This is the annoying thing about Ethereal Dreamer. Unless, oh, there we go. Thank you, Ronnie. I was gonna ask. Uh, I was gonna ask to see if someone could go and tell the players to put the uh, dreamers up. Yeah. yeah, those tokens on the Ethereal Dreamer. So he does choose air as the Ethereal Dreamer province. That's interesting. Air, air this early. Oh well, he probably wants to keep this shit out, right? Oh, that's true. This is really weird because Ronnie probably doesn't want to attack. Oh, yeah, because, you know, if you get the Keeper Initiate out, between that, Naive Student, and Asaba Morisato, you can, you can like, put a chokehold on the favor. Yes. Right? Because if Ronnie has uh, Kikita Yoshi, yes. you don't want him to get the Imperial favor. So that's why he bought Naive Student. That's probably why he's going to go air right now, right? Yeah. Get the... He- Look Get at that. The, uh, guy and, As I suspected, Ronnie did pass his first conflict. And Makes what's sense. the what's the card? Upholding authority. Upholding authority. Yeah. So Daijoji, um, we were just briefly explaining. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Keeper. Keeper I, and just kind of choking out of honor pretty early is also nice. Well, I think the primary reason. Oh, there's an assassinate. But the primary reason, uh, Daijoji Eric, I think is. You get the keeper out, and then you're between that and uh, your box and the knight student. You've got six glory, yeah. And uh, you can deny Ronnie getting the favor pretty easily that way, which is important because he has uh, Kikiri Yoshi uh, showing on his province.
pretty pretty clean break. Yeah, <clears throat> feeling pretty good about this actually. Oh yeah, let's get rid of the uh, Marcus Shames. Ho ho. Right. Get him out of there. Yeah. Just get him out of there. That's yeah, not that bad, I think. Yeah. Well, Williams not that worried. I mean, he's uh, unless unless Ronnie has something like uh, Steward of Law in his hand or what's that? What's that Crane character? Is it a uh, Iron Warrior? Iron something? Oh yes, yes, yes. Um, Iron Guard Warrior, I think it's called. Menacing Iron Warrior, I think it's called. Yeah. Does he does he have it though in his list? Do you see it there? No. Okay, he doesn't have it. Did you show it up though? No, that's fine. And what he does is uh, what he does have is a uh, Goblin Sneak. Goblin Sneak gonna go for a poke against Kadaka, I guess. Snick. What do you what do you want to do here? Do you want to go for a uh, water poke? Military water. Military water. Make him defend with Keeper Initiate. And then maybe, if, if and you're then... successful, you get to bow the knight, student. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, you uh, potentially can uh, deny the favor to William. Now, that is also a good option. Void is also good, too. Oh. oh. Nah, not to that <laughs> problem. So sad. Meditations. Womp womp. Do you defend this? Do you bother defending this? No. No. I wouldn't. Because, like... Meditations is a good province, but it's not like one of your big provinces that you want your opponent to keep getting into. Like, you want them to get into things like Shameful quite often, or I mean, Acre Garden often. Things like that. Meditations is good every now and then, but... I think he's deciding right now whether yeah. or not to... Uh, to defend? Yeah. Yeah. Looks like no defenders. Oh, press the reset button on the top. Oh, there we go. Okay. Okay, so losing the honor for an opposed. Yep. I'm pretty sure. You ended up voiding the dreamer, right? Yeah. Did he not lose an honor for an opposed? So I think political earth to both, sending a value of three. Makes sense. Shameful display. Okay. Okay. So. Let's bow one of them. Probably the keep. Yeah. Naive student. And then pass. Use Shizuka Toshi, I guess. To bow? Yes. Yes. Bow the character with the. Uh, yes, as and I went over there and reminded him. He did lose the honor for unopposed. Yeah, makes the keeper initiative become zero. <laughs> Probably attack with. <laughs> Seeker of knowledge. Yeah. I would assassinate this. For sure. See this? Yeah. Might as well. Easy assassinate. You pay fee for it? Fine. I will pay three honor. Still. Uh, so who do you think has the advantage right now? I think it's still William. Well, I mean. William's going to draw a card. He's going to have. He's going to be the only guy with a character on board. Keeper initiate doesn't even need to be doing any attacking next turn. But uh, yeah, down to six already. Uh, this is this is the kind of situation where William, I mean, may even be inclined to just bid one next turn. Yep. And uh, but I, I don't think he's gonna. He might he might hold off for another minute until he starts drawing his uh, backhanded compliments. It's true. He does get an honor for that uh, nice student leaving, putting him back at nine. I think at this point the air ring is going to be the the ring that's going to be fought over the most. Mm -hmm. William most likely going to be playing Kadaka on his next turn, unless something better comes up. Did anyone get the favor there? No. Yeah, it was one ring to one ring. Okay.
what's next. Okay, so we got first player token passing to... Got it. <clears throat> oh, double Kudaka, another Ethereal Dreamer. This is actually a pretty good flop for William. Mm -hmm. So what do you oh. what do you go? Spend maybe... So I'm thinking... Five. Five on the first Kudaka dupe and then play Ethereal Dreamer, no fate? Yes. Uh, I would probably still play Ethereal Dreamer with one fate. That's all your money, though. Yeah, but I mean, like, what, what has Ronnie got on his side? Like, Cow's Delegate. Oh, is Benton's Touch an error uh, spell, or is it a fire spell? Yeah, bring that up. It's an air spell. Okay, that makes sense. That's why he bought Uona. In fact, he might actually, yeah, he's not going to buy Kadaka this turn. This makes more sense. Because, yeah, because Ronnie's going to have to be forced to set up his... Well, yeah, Ronnie doesn't have any military power here, right? Nope. But accidentally running into... Hmm, interesting. Now, yeah. Ronnie does have the Imperial Palace this turn. It's on an unbroken province. Yeah, let's see what Will does here. Is he going to go to... Is he going to start bidding one now? Two, maybe. Two? Oh, but look at Ronnie. He, he saw it coming. Ronnie knew what the score was. I think they they played a bunch of games together already, right? Yeah. Yeah. William's been playing this deck for a while. Display of power. Mm -hmm. Cloud the mine. Cloud the mine's not really going to do anything in this situation, though. Yeah, not really. Ronnie's hands. I see Mark of Shame. I see uh, Beyond Re Soul Beyond, Beyond Reproach. Roach. Yeah, Roaches. You see any. I saw one conflict character in his hand there. Couldn't really tell what it was, though. I'm trying to lean on the side of the screen again to see yeah, a better, better le view. Lean further. Yeah. See, maybe yeah. you can see his hand. <laughs> he won't let me see it, though. What a scumbag. What a guy. I know. What an edge board. <laughs> <laughs> this guy with his white play mat ruining the color balance of my camera. Oh. No respect. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I wonder how the other match is going. Well, Zachary, it's Zachary and uh, Shane. Yeah. And they, uh, they played actually last round. Mm-hmm. And um, Zach, won. Zach won, yeah. yeah. So this is a rematch. Well, Zach's least... really tough. I, I I would say he's one of the best players in Toronto. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Ethereal Dreamer going after the air again. He's going to... Yep. Military, military uh, most likely. Mm, I think if you were going to do military, you'd go Iona too. Yeah, yeah this, you're right. This, this is fine. <clears throat> Ooh, match straight station. <laughs> I wonder if Ronnie's going to burn a Soul Beyond Reproach on a Whisper just to be able to stand it. Double block. Yeah. What? What? Oh. Oh. What's going on? He is going to go military. Oh, military. Yeah. After seeing it? I don't know about that. Is that what happened? Oh. I don't know. Good guy, Ronnie. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Okay. Now, I can see why William would do it anyway. I mean, he's got a bonsai in his hand. And if you're gonna attack a province that has the uh, Imperial Palace on it, like you're gonna you're you're gonna attack it with the intention of destroying it, I would imagine you're gonna really want to commit to it. Fair enough. Plus, uh, yeah. Ooh. Well, so this is a military conflict. Mm -hmm. we got three. No, we'll play the captive audience as oh, an attacker. Yeah. So that's okay. what happens. When's he going to play the Cavalry Reserves to get all those uh, Cavalry Shigenja? <laughs> I guess this is a block, so it's a 3-0. Ronnie playing the Tetris now. Now he's playing the Tetris with his cards. Mm -hmm. We got we to gotta be a little bit quiet now. Yeah. Now there's less all the people in All here. the kids are gone. All the Magic Kids. That was pretty stressful. Now, Benton's Touch... No, the Benton's Touch doesn't do anything here. No. Oh. Wow, just right away, huh? Oh, that's very interesting. Fire it off. 
So okay. that's going to bring him down to two. <laughs> nope. Zero. No, zero. Sorry, you're right. Zero is still, glory. I, yeah. I, was still, <laughs> I was still on the political conflict mode. Yeah. I don't give a... What's dishonor? <laughs> Go for bonsai. If you if you if he mark ashamed you, you know what what the hell's going on. He's gonna bend his switch to try to honor his. Uh, yeah. Wait, is he worried about for shame? I guess. Yeah, I think uh, so. Oh, uh, you know what? And then it has the added benefit of uh, because of Olona. Mm -hmm. Doesn't she get to bow and on? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Back up strat. Did did he just forget? No. R bring up Uona. I, 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 does she have to be participating? Is that how it works? Okay, she just forgot. Yeah. Or he just forgot. Mm-hmm. This trigger. Too bad, so sad. Full shame. I don't know if he paid honor for that, but I think he did. No, I... No. Oh. No, because he has 10 on her, so I just forgot to knock it off. Okay. With the bonsai. So, <clears throat> one, two, zero, ha, ha, ha. Oh, is Will thinking about playing full price for Ningyo? <laughs> I see. I'm he's, surprised. He's stung in I'm surprised it. Ronnie didn't hand. play uh, Yogo Kikuyo. Did he have Kikuyo on his he hand? He did, he did. It, probably because he didn't, like... There's better spells to counter. What are, what are you going to counter? You're going to counter yeah. against the waves. I think Kukuyo's... Oh, look at that. Defense of the Keeper of Air. Got to get that fate, yo. <laughs> Rare trick. I got to be honest with you. I, whenever I play a Keeper role, I never remember the fate part. I just never remember the fate. Rip. <clears throat> what are you thinking? Political... Yeah, that was a confusing attack by William. I'm not sure what... Uh, like the yeah. Benton such made sense, Sorry. but the I think it's you just forgot the the trigger there. Yeah. But see, Political this is this is the problem. This is the danger when you uh, when you start bidding one too early. Now, now your opponent just like rides the uh, earth ring hard, discards your hand. <laughs> Tiff J two hundred said that. Uh, Ask what happened. So, long story short, we did. Uh, we'll try to be the province. Um, Why bonsai after steward of law? No, I. Well, I mean, Ron, Will probably didn't know that uh, he had a uh, for shame in hand. Yeah. If that was the case, he would have started off with mm -hmm. uh, steward of law first. Yeah. But to waste more resources on. Will's side. I think it just brings up. I think it's just fatigue, right? Like, <laughs> this is. Oh, no, thank you. <laughs> you know, we were talking about better spells. Yeah, that's yeah, pretty yeah, much a better yeah, spell. That, that's a better spell. Yeah, that's a better spell. Ooh, crowd of mine. Yes, please. And you get the Earth Ring too. And yes, you get sir. The Earth yum, yum. Salty Ronnie might actually win a game here. <laughs> 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 Uh, yeah, he, uh, he played, <laughs> yeah, William, William attempted to display a power, the earth ring attack that Ronnie was doing that was undefended. And, uh, as a result, yeah, as, as a result, Kikuyo, uh, Kikuyo canceled it. That seems weird. I don't even want to attack with this keeper initiate. I don't even want to block with it. I don't think you attack with it. I think you just let it be. Yeah. And and Ronnie has a magistrate station now. Ugh. Yeah. I think I think. What do you think? You think attacking firing just to deny it from Ronnie? That could work. But where do you go here? Back to the station. Yup. Oh, this time, I'm ready. I'm ready. I got the bow. I got no, the... you don't do the bow now. No. Oh, yeah, for sure. You do when that when that knee when that. <laughs> then Ningyo comes when out. That, when that creature comes in, yo, I want to talk to you real quick. Yeah, talk to you real quick. Oh, you just slipped on the <laughs> slipped on the icy road. Yeah. <laughs> Banana slip. Banana peel. <laughs> got blue shelled. 
<laughs> That's funny. Oof. I can hear all the way from here. She's already done her job. Who, Kikuyo? Yeah. No, um... Hitoji Whisper. I'm already here. I'm here to block. Oops. Yeah, once, uh... That's it? That's it. Wasn't worth it. Time to go military fear. See what I mean? Keep hitting that meditation of the towel. Yep. Just rumph, rumph, rumph. What? Void. Okay. Wait, oh, is yeah, it supposed I, to fire, you mean? Yeah. No, 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 I, I get it. I get it. The Cal Delegate's <laughs> leaving this turn, right? Also, Ronnie gets to go first, which means he gets yeah. access to the firing before yeah. Will does. So, I get it. I see now. So, who do you think, who would you void here? Would you void Uona or Ethereal Dreamer? I think it's Dreamer. Really? I think Uona. Yeah, Solar Z. It detects against Phoenix because um, a lot of the... So, as some of you who have been looking at the uh, Lotus Pavilion tournament page, there's no Scorpion today. A lot of the Scorpion players have switched over to Phoenix uh, because I think it, they think it has a better matchup against Dragon, which is true. Uh, especially post uh, rotation, so I think Ronnie was expecting a lot of Phoenix decks, well, a lot of Phoenix matchups anyway. So that's why he's playing Kakuyo again. <clears throat> yeah, see, he went. He went after. He went. He went after Uona there. Yeah, I think you're right. I think that is a better idea. So, hmm. I think he now try to break meditations now. Now that you have character, ooh, here we go. Hmm. There's Ronnie's spirit animal. <laughs> <laughs> really, challenger. <clears throat> yeah, that's pretty cool. I think. I guess so. Yeah. William, William only really has... Well, ah, so look at that, eh? Two. Yeah, he doesn't need to buy anything yet. I guess... Uh, yeah. What's really going to be interesting is what the, the bids are going to be this turn. So Still going to be one, I no, think. No, William's got to go back to five. He can't. That means Will's going to be down on honor. I don't think he can risk doing that. I think Ronnie's going to try to... I think Ronnie might bid three again. And then that way if... Uh, no, I think one player's going to be at one. There's, it's still the risk of... I think Ronnie, Ronnie's bid's going to be three. You can't, you can't keep bidding one, Miss William, can you? Oh, two. Yeah, see? It's still pretty bad for Will. Like, remember, he's not, he's not playing the new Stronghold, so he can't, he can't rebuy any of his spells. Yeah. Although, at this point, he's probably going to lean really hard on Kadaka to try to... to, try to get some cards like this is the awkward part is like ronnie's gonna attack like political like um three seven two meditations yeah and like um probably win the fire ring and then he's gonna just kill kudaka right maybe does he have a noble sack in his he, hand i think he does okay yeah i'll double take a look yeah you t you attack with both uh Doji Whispers, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Because they don't get affected by the Just meditations. don't attack with Sturvala, or your planet falls apart. Hmm. Oh, uh, why did he touch a Sturvala? <laughs> it's the... No, no, it's the <laughs> shift. You're like, I don't like where this fits, so I'm just oh, going to sure. move it aside and then attack with these oh, two. Tetris. See? Okay. Yeah, here, see? Yeah, here's the double whisper attack, like you said. Yeah. Firing. Incoming eyepiece. Just right in the, right in the pocket. Right in the pocket. <laughs> oh, takesy backsies. What oh. is this? Oh, oh, dang. Yeah. yeah. Okay. You're Damn. a mind reader, son. Damn. Damn, you're good. Damn, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> so, Voice of Honor is active on Ronnie's side. It is. Wow, here we go. Okay. Losing on a front of post. 
Okay, keep it there. Keep her very, yeah. All yeah, right. keep her Fire very, it keep it there. Fire it off. Oh, no, he doesn't have it. Never mind. Oh, it was a Soul Beyond reproach, yeah, I guess. I, See, yeah. they look so similar when you're thumbing through. Uh, yeah, I got Ruse so hard. I don't know what ring uh, Elemental Dreamer's on. Uh, that's a good question. I'm going to guess air. Okay. Okay. It's got to be air. Interesting. What ring does Will go after here? Air? Right? He's got to do air, I think. Yeah. He's got to start accumulating those cards back up again. Yeah, I think you're right. I think so much, so does the, uh, oh, I see it. You're right. Never mind. Yep. A bridge? <clears throat> so Raz, yeah. I did see it briefly. The noble sacrifice. Oh, a bridge. <laughs> Isn't it the front card? Instead? It is. Oh, I it see is. it. I see it the is. bridge. I saw you. I thought like we were talking about like dredge or something. Bridge. Bridge <laughs> from below. <laughs> <laughs> no, isn't this like that new, uh, what's that new Orzov um, instant? Sacrifice a creature, destroy target creature. Pay five life for a sac creature. Have you seen that card? I haven't really caught up on the newest. Uh, uh, I don't care about magic anymore. Yeah. Magic's boring. <laughs> it ain't no all five ever. <laughs> No, L5 are a special kind of boring. Oh. <laughs> <Not jokes. laughs> I, I think I need to confirm what ring that's on, because I don't know what value I need to fit this to. I'm going to... Let's guess it's four. Oh, oh Game of Sedani. Oh. I don't know, man. Wait, does, doesn't it... Does Game of Sedani give a bonus if a character is a duelist? No. No, no it just honors and dishonors the winner okay. and the loser. But I don't know who's the... I think you bit two. I think I got a bit two. So right now it's three to one, right? One. Uh, that's that so cancels we, it, right? No, so nothing happens. Ronnie still wins. Four against three. Oh, you're right. Oh, four against no, four. Four against four. Yeah, 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 okay. yeah, yeah. You're right. Well, that is buffer room. It's actually not bad. Is it on air? Yeah, of course, it's on air. Where are the fingers? No. I didn't see it. Soul Beyond Reproach. Wow. Wow. Okay. Okay. Cool. 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 <laughs> cool. 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 Wonder why he's waiting so long. I, I guess there's no it's rush. A, it's the. Come on. I'm going to give you a no, false no, sense of hope. You know what he's trying to do? He's, no, he's trying to let. False sense of hope. Yeah. He's trying to get William to burn as many cards as possible to win the air ring. Yeah. And it lasts me to be like, nope. No <laughs> Kadaka for you. Not today, dear bag. Just to play it. What you're waiting for. Oh, you know what? He's... Uh, oh, Magistrate Station. There's actually six, but, you know, whatever. It's yep. fine. Mm -hmm. Magistrate Station, get up. Oh, yeah, I think I, you got to kill this now. There he is. Yep. Bye-bye, Bye, Felicia. Bye, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Felicia. So that puts William at four. Ugh. Wow. I Actually, didn't realize. Uh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> yeah, holding off on the bridge. Give him that false sense of hope. <laughs> I got to get, get you like a fidget spinner or something, Sungo. <laughs> the, the commentator fidget spinner. <laughs> yeah, what, that my yeah. uh, Why would you only attack with oh. one character? You oh no, that's military, man. Ronnie, that's military. <laughs> <laughs> Why attack with one character? Uh this is his second conflict, right? It is. Is he trying to... Well, yeah, I mean, he's he doesn't need to hold off on the glory or whatever. I don't know. 
is he just uh, is he just like trying to just basically slowly win by dishonor? Maybe. I mean, it's already a three. Do you want to leave himself a part of Provost of Prime? Yes. Ah, yeah. That's good. Yeah. That's a good point, actually. When I say things, they probably can't hear me, so you can just do it. Okay, so producer Travis said the reason why he just attacked with the one character is... Uh, well, I mean, Shameful Display is not really a farmable promise. No, but, but I mean, at the m moment, at the yeah. time, when <laughs> we'll only have three cards in hand, probably doesn't have a conflict character, and if he ends up hating on Shameful Display by accident... Right. Yeah, Stuart Elias says, I don't care. Yeah, I guess so. so. Makes sense. Oh, true, <laughs> because Stuart Elias doesn't get dishonored. Mm-hmm. You're so smart. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Uh, I think it's time I can't, for I can't tell. his spirit animal. <laughs> no, he discarded his spirit animal. No, his spirit animal's right there. Where? His real uh, spirit animal. Oh, no. I thought Guest of Honor was a spirit animal. No, no, no. This is a true... It's okay. like It's like, you know how Brash Samurai is the real clan champion? <laughs> oh, yeah. 1-1. <laughs> 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 I'm calling it. Oh, sorry. I'm calling it. 1-1. One, one. He played a Mia Mystic. Mm-hmm. What? Yeah, probably do... Uh, because cause Ronnie probably wants to um, yeah. keep the Kita Asami up for the... Um... Oh, man, I'm drawing a blank here. Uh, so that the Cloud of Mine doesn't uh, blank it. Right. What's going on? He's cracking the Imperial Storehouses. No, no, I think, I think Ronnie wants to do something before uh, that comes up. Right hand stacked. He's got a censure. I know. And a voice of honor. And a way of the crane. Oh, peasant's, peasant's advice. advice. Oh man. <laughs> I can't believe that. That's oh a man. What a scumbag. Wow. I've never seen that. <laughs> what the What? <laughs> peasant's advice on a pure sword. Oh my goodness. I mean, he probably he probably <clears throat> just wanted mostly for the for the to peek at the province, but that's hilarious. No cards for you. Peasant's advice. That's that's actually Ronnie's spirit animal in the conflict deck. Mm -hmm. That's his like favorite card. Mm -hmm. I think he had enough. Whoa. He hell? hates he hates Imperial Pals so much. Yeah. So. Well, in the um, Hidden Moon Dojo, back when Scorpion was good. Pepper's Farm remembers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ryan doesn't care now. Now he just doesn't care about card value. He just honor everything. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to win it. That's definitely the play of the game. That's the play of the tournament. If we had the ESPN play of the week, that would be like... <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> That's its advice. <laughs> <laughs> I think we attack Void. Yeah. Oh, Revolution. Match, uh, match cons. Yeah, overthrow the bourgeoisie. That's, see that? that. One, two, three. Hmm. Do, you, you're gonna pull in a mediator here, right? You can only do that during. Oh, the on the attack. Okay. Surprised he did that with the attack. Oh, I see what's gonna go on. Well, Drani's not gonna be attacking more than once this turn anyway, right? Yep. Because the mediators. Yeah, that's fine. Ronnie runs. Does Ronnie run uh, Frostbitten Crossing? No, he no. uses Manicure Garden. Calling in favors, right? Just let it be. Gets up the Magister Station, attack mili uh, military with Doji Challenger to somewhere, and then... Mm, I don't know. Maybe political? No. Yeah, you have to do political, because you want to steal on it, right? Yeah. Political air, perhaps? Yeah. Ready the... <coughs> 
<clears throat> Wait, what happened? Did why did he move the? Uh, why did he move the? Cloud the mind. What? I just saw him in the comments on the previous video. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Wow, okay. Um, so hitting manicure garden with six, it looks like. Yeah, it looks like it. Six political. <laughs> TFT two hundred. Good thing you're not playing me, cause. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Sungho loves the counter spells. Yo, I love those counter spells. Those free counter spells. Yum, yum. <laughs> So, no defenders, huh? Interesting. What? So now he's at one? Oh my god. Oh, display? Uh -oh. <laughs> no, no, no. No power for you. No power for you, sir. Dang, we're down to one honor. Yeah, that puts him at one, right? It's not good. Uh oh. <clears throat> So now, wait, that was William's second conflict, right? <coughs> Did, Will, uh, no, no. Will hasn't done his second conflict yet. Oh, okay. Wait, so who did the first conflict? The Psalm Scholar did against the Magister Station with Earth. Ah, oh, right, okay. You can only almost yeah. see it at the end of the tunnel. Well, Ronnie, I think Ronnie is going to... He also has Marco Shame in his hand. So, so you just played on Psalm Scholar, right? Yeah. GGs? Yeah. Well, but you're going to have to fend off this attack first. Yeah. I mean, you probably Because he's going to go this. for air. He's, yep. So he has he six. has to. Six versus uh, Kikita's five. Military. Oh, political. Okay. Six to five. And court then, games. Court games you, which okay. is going to court games me. So that brings him to four, right? Or five, five rather. Sorry, mm -hmm. five to five. five yep. <laughs> yeah, I think I think. Oh, no. no. <laughs> Assassinate. Wow. Yo, let me talk to you for a sec. <laughs> yo, me, yo, okay, yo, okay, yo, okay, can I talk to you for so, a sec? So, the, like, I think I think uh, William got a bit of tunnel vision there. There was like that turn where things didn't turn out for him. He's kept bidding yeah. one. Yeah. I don't think. Yeah. Uh, it was not wise to attack the palace on a face down province, I think. Yeah. It's a, you see, the thing is, it's also like the strategic part of that as well, where if you put a good character or a good province or like good holding or something, yeah. underneath that province is probably something that you want, they want you to go into. Like if you put like a Hotaru or Kakita Yoshi out in front of like a face down province. There's most likely a province like that you want. What do you to mean? Like if you buy a <coughs> Kikita Yoshi? No, no. So, in the, in this case, let's say right. instead of uh, Imperial Palace, it was Kikita Yoshi underneath the Magister Station. Okay. The opponent's like, oh man, I want to get this thing. Not, I don't want to deal with this. So I'm gonna have to attack it. Right. So you basically bait them into attacking that province, which is good for the Crane player because you want that province to be flipped up really. Oh, early. I see. Okay. Yeah. <coughs> <clears throat> Interesting. See, yeah. I don't play Crane that much, so I. Don't yeah, know. I mean, it's also dependent on different like clans too, right? Like, if you yeah. want them to run into shameful display, you put uh -huh. them into like a, a good holding or some sort of good unit or something right. like that. So, uh, that ran episode of our assignment.